a uh, structure for resolving uh, the Israeli-Palestinian conflict now exists. And I think the Bush administration deserves some credit, notwithstanding its, its uh, failure to treat this issue seriously for its first seven years. It deserves credit in its last year for putting this process essentially back on track. And it's operating now and, and needs to be picked up by the administration on four levels. Final status negotiations, the improvement of the uh, capabilities of the Palestinian security services, the pursuit of uh, uh, a uh, uh, rebuilding of the Palestinian economy, uh, the effort to get both sides to live up to their roadmap commitments, which includes a total freeze on settlement activity, including natural growth and the dismantlement of unauthorized Israeli settlements, and on the Palestinian side, a serious effort to dismantle the structure, infrastructure of terror. Uh, and uh, on a fourth level, there is the uh, involvement of the Arab states, which represents a new and important development that needs to be pursued as well. What's missing from this structure is a fifth level, uh, which would provide it with a comprehensiveness that uh, we believe would significantly enhance uh, progress on the Palestinian track. And that is uh, Israeli-Syrian negotiations. Uh, they have been conducted under Turkish mediation uh, for some 12 months now. And uh, they re represent, as Richard already suggested, an opportunity, uh, which we think that the uh, Obama administration needs to uh, develop. Uh, 